welcome back to this coffee cup design style and we'll create three different styles here okay the first will be a flat design so we can start with a rectangle tool if you click on your rectangle tool you can add this color and choose two here if you want and click the rectangle here okay and if you click on your direct section tool you can select those two anchor point as i select those two anchor point height s to choose your scale tool and decrease this line size and you can choose your line segment tool create a line segment in the top increase the stroke and run cap okay and duplicate it if you hide selection tool hold option or alt to duplicate it and hold option to decrease the size okay you can duplicate it again in the center it is the same flat design that you want to create here and you want to do it funny so create this funny design okay this is our flat design very simple let's go for the second style okay for the second design let's create with rectangle tool a rectangle here again and decrease this soft weight and add this color okay we can change it after and with your direct selection tool do one click there hold shift another click with s to scale tool decrease the bottom okay and you can decrease it that way okay if you do one click on your selection direct selection tool one click hold shift another click and run cap okay here you want to create another rectangle here okay with direct selection tool one click another click s to scale tool decrease that way and direct selection tool do one click run cap that key selection tool decrease a little bit okay fine I think it's fine now so change this color for this color and if you want let me add this color go there change it that way okay fine okay we have a good type to create a shadow quickly how you can do it command C copy it to copy your shape command f command f again so you have free shape here okay select the top with your right key your keyboard you can set it in the right side hold shift to select the second shift m to shift by the tool hold option or alt to delete this part select this remove stroke color add white color go to transparency and decrease the opacity okay fine you can do the same for this command c command f command f again set it in the this size shift to select this shift m to shape the other tool all option or alt to delete this click on it use i drop it tool to copy quickly this configuration okay after that we want to create a small logo here so l l is tool create a logo that way and with your line segment tool you can create a line segment here increase the stroke use this form okay increase again and with your curvature tool you can create a design that way section tool 
to receive in the center do one click go there expand the parents select both and buff from there and there okay change color for a color that look like a coffee okay and you have your small logo that you can place it here okay place it in the center now you want to add shadow again in this part so click on your pen tool do one click there another click there one click there another click there close hold select select shift m this is this part and add black color on this black color and transparency decrease opacity you can do the same for this command c command f command f again set it hold shift I shift to copy this shift M to delete this part I drop it tool to copy this configuration so you have your shadow now you want to click the top click on your rectangle tool click the top and the accession tool Increase it a little bit. Just on to room top. Add this black color. Now do one click. Command C, Command F, Command F again. Set it in the with your right and bottom key in your keyboard. You can set it there and hold Shift to select this second. Shift M to delete this. And if you use iDrop it tool, you can copy copy this configuration. And you can do the same for the right side. Okay, hold shift to one click there. Shift M delete this. Do one click iDrop it tool and copy this shadow. Okay, fine. Now you want to create a top a last top design this top you want to copy this color if i drop it tool remove sock and with direct on tool select those two anchor point and room tab and you can copy it do one click command x to copy it select this command d to paste it in the background of this shape okay after that you want to create lighting here and shadow here command c command f command f again with your key your right key and bottom key on your keyboard you can place it there and with selection tool select all shift and select this shift m to use your shape value to delete this part with i drop it tool copy this part okay fine the same manipulation Click on it, command C, command F, command F again with your left key on your keyboard. Hold shift, select this, shift M, shape by the tool, hold option or alt, delete this, I drop it tool, co copy this configuration. Okay, this is your your shadow. Okay, now you want to you want to create a design here with pen tool. Do one click there, another click there. Hold shift another click another click another click another click and the last click here uh, if you want and with selection tool select your shape remove the file add black here increase and uh, with select direct selection tool run cap click there run cap and with C in your keyboard to select your six or two you can cut there select this part delete it again see cut cut delete cut cut 
and delete okay fine this is your design select all go there expand okay place it there decrease the size and you want to create a funny a fun background ls tool hold shift and option put an ellipse and add with i drop it tool copy this color select the command x to, to cap it click on your face your first shape and command b to paste it in the back and you can create a this click there and for this add this color and for this add this color and you can increase if you go if you click there double click use this and do it a small block okay fan and after that uh, you can use gradient tool and create this design okay fine after that you can use your line segment and create a line segment there increase the stroke select both if shape by the tool did it there and now you have a design that is finished okay fine this is our second design command g to group them and you can increase the size if you want and this is your second design let's go for the 4d design so we can start with a white color in the file and use rectangle tool okay here you will create a small rectangle that way another rectangle here select both with selection tool select both and with shape by the tool no merge in the center okay after that you can you can click on your direct selection tool click on this hold shift click on this and set it that way okay by hold shift okay after that you want to create another rectangle in the top select both shift m hold option with shape by the tool delete that here and with pen tool go there to add two anchor point one there another there select with the accession tool this two in the bottom hard shift blue color blue color and the delete this stroke okay after that click anyway to select all click on add this uh, color white color and click on your rectangle tool m create a rectangle here fine after that if you click on direct section tool you can do one click there set it a little bit in the center a little bit okay if you want you can increase it a little bit okay fine after that you want to create with a rectangle again a small design here let me do it big small design in that way and add this color and duplicate it by duplicate it by whole option in the bottom and hide command d to repeat action okay after that select all with your shape by the tool you can delete this and delete this and with your rectangle tool you want to create a rectangle here okay and add a white color and if you click on your selection tool you can hold shift to select this and shift m to use shape by the tool to delete here okay this is your first design select all command g to group them and place it there now you want to create a logo a simple logo and click on your your ellipse tool click an ellipse here set color in the stroke and add black color and increase a little bit if you want here you can click on your uh, skill tool hold hold your click first hold shift second hold alt third and decrease the cycle do the same manipulation okay fine after that select all and decrease a little bit duplicate it here 
okay after that you want to create a rectangle a rectangle here and a round cap of your rectangle set it top you want to select all this selection tool shift m for your shape builder tool and delete do the outside your rectangle delete this first merge do that here merge do that here I do that here. We have something there what that we want to delete. Delete this. Okay, fine. Click on your ellipse tool. Click a design that way. Click a line segment with curvature tool. You can curve that way and that way. And use this form. I rotate it. Okay. Do one click shift X to set color there. And first click there go there to expand it and select both go to path from there and click on click there okay fine you can set it that way okay it's fine now so select all command g to group them go to your symbol click there to add it okay and okay, you can delete this now freely revolve okay i want to notice you that this part can freeze your pc if your pc is not very strong go to live thing and go down click, click on shadow click there to and go to top and change rotation value uh, add our logo so go to materials go down to find your logo your simple logo click on it you can do it big or small it's good that way after that if you want to create a realistic you can click there this option can also freeze your pc you can go to object and click on expand the parents to release the 3d effect on your design and you can move it okay this is our design let me okay here we are this is our coffee cup design in different style don't forget to said me that we have don't understand in comment and and let me know that you think about this design and don't forget to subscribe and like and share see you next